gameplays with commentary. Do support for more videos. Comment, like, and subscribe for more. In this game, I will be building a damage focused Kha'Zix. Instead of going for Gluttonous Greaves for sustain, I'm going to build Berserker's Greaves instead, which also gives bonus attack speed, which means clearing camps will be faster. Gluttonous does have 35 damage, which is higher than Berserker's. It only has 18 damage, but its bonus attack speed contemplates it. The enemy team has a lot of shield-based abilities, which makes Serpent Fang a great first build. It reduces shields also gives bonus AD. As an assassin you will need leads early on. Falling behind with Kha'Zix makes you useless cause. You don't have any crowd control. The only viable way for him on harder team fights is upgrading his second ability. I'm helping with vision on the map for my team. Now fight would be on the top side by now cause. He didn't show up on the ward I placed on Scuttle Crab earlier. Always evolve your first ability it is your main source of damage. They are fighting I'll prop my ghost. We could still go for a tower dive. As I thought Malphite is on top side. That's why early wards are important so. We'll know where the enemy team jungler is paving. Get boots early to move around the map faster. Especially on the jungler roll. You have so much to do on the map. Moving around faster gives more opportunities to make a play. That's why I'm going to build Yumu's Ghost Blade for my second build. I can't fight Yon his level is higher than mine and his well fed. I'll just back away then get my item. Objectives are respawning soon we will need a play to secure it. He just flashed I'll still prop my ghost so I can make it on time. Lucian still died though. Yon will soon be a headache later on the game. Just collect the CS or you can hold the wave for your liner. I picked collecting because Lucian would need to just shove the wave later for an objective fight. See that Luxult has a bigger area of effect than expected. Scuttle crabs are important for securing visions. I sometimes skip camps to get it. Midline has priority so, I decided to just go for Dragon. Enemy team botline still on base. Don't know why Yon is here instead of collecting CS on mid. He might have thought he could get Vayne. Nailfight is here he didn't although he might have used it on the way so he can reach the Dragon faster. Yon is getting fed more. It's a waste of time to go for Harold now. Cause they would have killed it already. Instead let's go for cross mapping. Diminishing resources of the enemy team jungler means we will have a bigger lead on him. It's okay to give objectives that are too risky. Or when you can't go there on time. Even when your team spam pings you, don't mind them. Upgrading my third ability next so I can go in and out. I can't defend mid all by myself so I'll leave it. Lucian is spawning anyway. Yon is not there so, I decided to defend it. So glad he didn't have ult. Zed is low and he did use his ult earlier let's chase him down.
I saw around three enemies on bot line, so it's okay to invade the jungle. Yon is still missing, though he might come here. Can't win against him yet, might be possible if I have alt. Just sway around to confuse your enemies. We are close to each other, there is a high possibility. That Malphite would ult. I won't go for Malphite cause we can't kill him fast enough. Waiting until Karma ult vanished. I don't have my jump yet it's hard to walk in. I'll have to back away cause Yon's backups are coming. It's better to give up the kill than dying. It's too risky going for the dragon I'll just give. We have no vision and my team is too far. I'll just pressure lines. They might come now positioning at the edge is better, so you can still react in case an enemy chases after you. I have vision on dragon and also my own. I'll go for it. Having vision on dragon makes the possibility of stealing it higher. I wasted my Jonia though I shouldn't have used it cause I'm dead anyway. Two of my teammates just died. I have no vision, and objective is respawning soon. So, I won't go for it. By the way I upgraded my second ability. To help on peeling the enemy team. I decided not to go to the Baron instead. I'll pressure the Dragon line. Enemies might be here now cause of the effect of Baron, which gives them faster back time. Let's try to get someone isolated. Too many enemies on mid. Elder just spawned I'll need to position their closer. Jinx is alone on Elder, let's get her. If you enjoyed this video so far consider commenting, liking, and subscribing. Very nice free Elder. Facts time. Did you know that the hunt is on between Cossacks and Ringer references Alien vs Predator? It's a movie if you have not watched it yet. You'll probably enjoy it cause it has many versions. You can pick from. My fifth item now would be the collector. I like it cause it executes enemies that are low which makes it easier to go in. And out specifically with third ability upgrade. Atrex is overextended that's why he died. Malphite showed up on top side. Two enemies are on bot line and one is dead. The best choice is to go for Malphite. He's all alone crying rocks. More videos of Kha'Zix on my channel with commentary. Check it out.
It helps a lot if you support this channel. Lux just annihilated the enemy team. Look at the minions. Hooray, to the minions, minions plus win equals winions.